welcome back. I'm the Game Beaver, and it's another episode of Jurassic World The Game. I was about to say Lego game there. No. So we have a hybrid arena this this weekend. Um, can you defeat a hybrid? Um, so, but it's not out yet. Oh, okay, just getting us prepared for no reason whatsoever. So, uh, this episode we're gonna just do the rounds of the park. I do want to say that um, in my last episode I gave a really long lengthy talk and I got lovely uh, lovely responses actually people saying I hate hackers damn it hate them uh, I wasn't actually talking about anyone in specifics um, but you see the thing is cheating has been around since I was a kid you when you were at school or you had a friend you you knew somebody who always had a cheat book who always like unlocked all the levels didn't put in all the work and you never liked them they were just like ah oh, god damn it. I do all this hard work, and here you are just doing it instantly. And um, oh, it's just I, I don't agree with it, especially like now because cheating was sort of allowed, whereas hacking is you know the game the makers or whatever you want to call them uh, developers of the game they don't want you to do that. And um, I mean I do hope that uh, Ludia sort of gets their game together because I know right now we're. This is it, this is the moment. It'll pass really quick, but right now, this is dinosaur. Dinosaur, 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 dinosaur. And it'll, as soon as you give it a month, you give it two months, it's gonna go. And, um, like, they should not be now taking loads of things away from the game. They should be, it should be like, yeah, yeah, I love this game. Oh, I'm gonna do this, do that. But right now, it's like, oh no, they took away that. They took away the mystery packs. They took away, uh, you can't buy DNA. They took away, they took away a lot of things. The only way to get DNA is to look at other games. Yes! The one thing that you want more in this game, you have to get by watching other people's games. <laughs> so that's stupid because isn't there more of a chance that people will go, you know what? No, that game looks more fun. Yeah, no, okay, never mind. Well, what are you gonna do? Lydia, I'll, I'll let you decide what to do with that, but, um,. I mean, that, I guess that's okay. I mean, to get free books, I understand. That makes sense, because books you can only get by doing missions or um, or paying. So it makes sense to, if you want to get them for free, you have to go through a little process. But DNA, there's no way to get DNA. The only way to get DNA is to watch adverts. And you can't even buy it. And I do ad admit that it adds a sense of challenge and, like, sort of achievement to it. The fact that you've accumulated all this DNA by playing a really long... But there comes a limit, guys! When it's just, it's, you know, an achievement and just... I just want it right now. I've got a surplus of everything else. And there is still no way in the game that I can do it. Also, in the last video, somebody said that uh, I didn't give a field test to this guy, so... If you bear with me, we're going to do a different hybrid. Yeah, that's right. <laughs> Got you all psyched for that one. And then we're doing this one. So the other, another hybrid that we can do. You've seen Spinoraptor. You've seen um, Stegoceratops. You've seen Indominus. Uh, this is a new one that we can get. Uh, as long as I don't spend all of my bucks and DNA on this. You know... It is just random. Some dinosaurs have, or some creatures have a higher chance of failing. Others have a less chance, like a lower chance. Um, but I've got like a max level 40 before and it's done it instantly. So it's something, it really is luck. It's luck, whether the game likes you or not. So this is a maxed zing. It's the first time I've got, oh, mission complete. Level up a dinosaur 26. Okay, well 10 bucks, that's fine. So, oh wow, he looks awesome. Oh, really cool. So let's see what it looks like maxed because then We get our option to fuse I'm wondering if that's with everything Do I have I you know pterodon can you fuse it? No, right. Okay, so it's only for the ones right now that you can fuse and eventually I'm pretty sure that they will put in so many options for fusing because That like I said there is just an unlimited option you could you could have triceratops with Eight others, and then there you go. That's already eight hybrids. So they've got to be selective. Um, I mean, I would really like for them just to release all of them and then for you to make your own. But uh, again, if they do that, that's a lot of work. And just like downloadable content in a game, app games need longevity. They need to have a way for you to keep playing them without getting bored 
over a long period of time. And the way they do that is through add-ons and downloads. Uh, games do it. I've done it for a long time with DLC, but they, uh, th for a while they didn't. They didn't. But now a game can't come out these days without having downloadable content on it. In fact, it went through a terrible stage where uh, Gears of War 3 came out. I remember Gears of War 3 coming out and uh, the content was on the disc. But it was literally like you had to you had to buy a separate code or a season pass to unlock it when it was released. And that was so... It's like, why? If it's there, just give it to me. Like, oh, it was just a money-hungry way of just trying to get the game to last a bit longer. And for you to shell out a little bit of money. Ah, but here we go. This is... I don't even know what this is. It looks and ugly. 350 DNA a pop. And that is for the first evolution. I don't want to know what it's like for the final ev evolution. Oh, God. Okay, well, I'm glad I have some DNA so we can see this guy. So we use a Tuki Toucan for this. Oh, that was only 700, so thank crumbs it wasn't anymore. There's a two-star hybrid. And there you go. Oh, my God. It looks... Oh, we got to place it down. And as soon as we place it down, four hybrids collected. So we'll put it in the position where Zing was before. So let's have a look. Um, wow. It's, I, it looks a bit like a Dracula um, bird. I don't know, I can see it. It's it's quite skinny. Uh, let's see its feeding animation. I think it's Zing's, yeah. It is Zing's animation. I don't know, for me, this looks like a legit pterosaur. It doesn't have anything about it that looks like a weird hybrid. Um, it looks... I feel like I saw this in a Walking with Dinosaur special. I don't even know what the uh, pterosaur was, but yeah, I like it. I like how its head is sort of like, it's like got an add-on little skull. So let's max it up to level 10 and see what it can do. I mean, it is a super rare um, hybrid. So there you go, 674 health, 258. It's about okay. As soon as you get two, you're, you're better than legendary, I think. As soon as you get two of these, uh, if it's a super rare hybrid. If it's a legendary hybrid, like a Dominus, at level 10, it is basically as good as a uh, level 40 legendary. So, oh, we don't have anything else. Um, I think the next one I needed, actually, is Carnoraptor. I think that's the next one I can get that's really close. Um, so we need a level... Yeah, Ankylodocus, nowhere near, because we need... We need uh, one more Diplodocus and a lot more Ankylosaurs. Probably about five. So Spanner after we've got, Indominus Rex we've got, Coolosaurus, close. We're, we've got already Kool-Aid, we don't have Sarcosuchus though. And there it is, it is called Choka, Trope, Tropogopterus, Tropogopterus. That sounds incredibly close to what it was called anyway, okay. Uh, yeah, Carnoraptor, so we need a level 40 Carnotaur and a level 40 Pyroraptor. Um, and this is the only, so far, rare hybrid, so not the best hybrids that we can get. So Pyroraptor, how close are we? Um, well, that's a level 30. One, two. We just need two more. Two more Pyroraptors. We've already got one waiting. So we'll put that in now. <coughs> oh, God. I felt a really horrible tickle in my throat there. Allow me to take a cup of tea and I'll be okay. Um, right. Did I skip past it? I don't think I did. There it is. Okay. So that is... We need two more. So we can buy one. I don't think Pyroraptor is too expensive. I can't imagine it being too expensive. It's like 500. It was one of the last ones you get. I remember that. Pyroraptor. Pyroraptor. There it is. Yeah, it is basically. Okay, 650. Yeah, I don't mind that. So let's check Carnotaur. So the next episode, we can get another hybrid. Um, so that's two level 20s, which make level 30. So we need two more. Two more Carnotaurs, and then we got a max. So, we could just fill our hybrids. We can fill this up. Um, I'm not going to. Because I could spend 75 bucks, and then for the next episode to have it ready. But, I'm going to be playing this before the next episode. So, I just have those two ready. Um, I can put something that's going to take a while in now. Um, so, a legendary. A Pterodon would be good. But... I've already got a max pterodon, so there's no real need for that. Ichthyostega I do need. Uh, Parasaurolophus is max, don't need that. Rajasaur I do. Prion Sutures, I need. I think, how many more Prions do I need? Um, so that's a level 30, I need four more Prions. Uh, Sarcosuchus. 
I need four more Sarkasukasas to make a level 40. And then we can get a Coolosaurus. Oh, I want to see a super Kool-Aid. We've got loads of these. Look at all them. Look at all the baby Kool-Aids. Um, so, for Ichthyostega, yeah, one, uh, two more for Ichthyostega to be maxed. We might as well, because it's going to take a while. Put you in. How much? 50 bucks. I don't mind. At least I can use my, uh, my books for something. Because right now, I've got nothing to spend books on. I can't, I don't need to buy coin. I don't need to buy food. Please, I would love to buy DNA. Um, it, I, it sucks that you can only get it in packs. And now, I mean, we could win a common pack. Let's do it. Let's win a common pack. Oh my god, oh Jesus. Okay, um, two Indominus Rexes and a Coolosaurus. Oh, okie dokie. Um, well, definitely Stegoceratops is out of there. Um, I could, look at that, look at that. 728. Look at the difference between 10 and 11 Indominus. It is literally 400 health and 200 almost attack. That's a lot. There's always a big jump, but that's quite scary. Especially Coolosaurus. I mean, it's not as deadly. In fact, it's not as deadly level 13 as a level 11 Indominus. And it is a legendary. I didn't realize that. Okay. Um, so we will have Macrobosaurus, Sarcosuchus, and then peck out your eyes. Right. We've got advantages on everything. I'm expecting him to switch into his Coolosaurus straight away. It costs a million! Oh yeah, also the price? Always a million. It always costs a million coin now. So, again, Ludia... Ridiculous! Because originally, it went random. It was it went in a cycle, so sometimes it would be 250,000, sometimes it would be 25,000. But now, every time you want to do an infinity mode, it's a million coin. I'm okay with that, because I get that every time I log in, I get a million coin. But seriously, come on, guys! Oh god, that roar, that's scary. Okay. Go on, Microbosaurus. I'd probably still say Microbosuchus or something. So, what do we do, guys? Reserve. I got, I've got to keep my wits about me, so two. Does go for the swap, did predict it. Oh, there it is! Oh my god! It's like a little tank! It's beautiful! Now, I would- I could switch in. I could switch in to my Pekka Urizes. But he might have three on his next go. And Indominus could kill Pteranodon. So there's no point in me doing that, even though I'd get the advantage. Um, now the one that I probably should have put in Sarkasukas first, because that way I could have meat shield. So I'm going to meat shield here. I'm going to hopefully go for all reserves. That's what I'm hoping for here. It did, it did, it does get three. It doesn't go for it, that's good, that's great. Okay, we can go for one, two, three, four, and a block. As long as we just get that eight. It wasted, saves one, gets four. What did you do with that four, buddy? Not using it! Okay! So now we can actually do something good here. One, two, three, four. Look at that, it could kill it in four! Oh my god, Sarko, you're, you're, um... Oh, it does! Oh my god! Coolosaurus ain't got nothing! Ain't got nothing on Sarko. And out comes the bad boy. Oh god. Goes for a seven! Strangely enough. Fine, that's okay. 5,000. Um, completely overkills me. He has one block left. Um, we've won. Simple as that, but wow. Wow, that was that was scary. Okay, one, two, three, four. Dead. Um, another four reserves. Three's killed it, right? I think it did. Belly flop! <laughs> Dead! Hybrids don't stand a chance. And this is an event this weekend? I've, I've fought three of them right now. Well, as long as I get a chance to win a, a legendary pack. And there you go. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. All dead. Even if it went for a full on four. Which it didn't. Okay. Yeah, it must have known it was screwed. And that, my friends. Like, if that was Jurassic World, it was so much easier. Just bring out Microbosaurus to kill Indominus. There you go. And we win a common pack. After all that, we win just a paltry, pitiful, 
Common pack. So what do we win? I think the max DNA we can win in this is... 500? I think 500. Or maybe 250. But we do get some, and it is 200. Okay. Ugh. Not great. And Pelicomimus, which we could probably sell. But again... Oh, really? Another common pack? Fine. And you know what? I've never done this in a while. I've never done the mystery. Because... It's five bucks, probably down the drain, for food or coin. Chances of winning a pack is very slim. But, saying that, I want to see um, these hybrids. What do you think? Should we go Should we go for the the um, the traffic light? Red, amber, and green. Let's do it. Okay. Full-on hybrids at the top of their game. Meaning they're, like, really good at level 10. So what would we be against? Oh, Ankylodocus. Awesome. I haven't seen that yet. Oh, we've won. Come on, we've so won this. Look at this. Okay, I'm going to go for a reserve because... Tropogathusus, or whatever it's called. Weird Skullhead. They call me Skeletor. Mwah! He might switch. Actually, no, I've got the advantage on everything with Spinoraptor. The only thing that doesn't have the advantage here is actually my own Skullhead. So I'm going to bring it in as a meat shield and just get two reserves. Look at the difference between a level 1 and a level 10. No, sorry, level 4 and a level 10. Not too much, actually. Go for 2. Go on, make my day. Go for 2. Just waste them. I know you're not a real person. Like, so many app games try to trick you into thinking you're fighting real people. But there's just so much against it. And I, look, it's so funny because people would watch this and go, No, they're real people, people. What are you talking about? But... I, I, I've yet to have anything to prove to me that these are real people. They've taken away the talking feature in Jurassic Park Builder. Um, okay, I, I haven't said why I think they're not real people at all. Um, what what does that make me believe they're real people? Okay, they take a long time to pick their what's happening. Okay, that's fine. But they always put in relative team to yours. Always, it's always sort of even. And I am going to go for four attacks here. Yeah, they always put in an even team. And you might be saying, well, maybe the servers for Jurassic World, the game, said it like that. But are you kidding me? That every time I do this, hey, there's always a person who makes exactly the same sort of team as to me? Every time I do it? No, don't believe it. Rubbish. <laughs> Let's go for four and another four attack. As long as I get eight, I'm cool. Oh, look! Putting in more blocks! But at least we do something. 129. My god, we're against a disadvantage here, but we're doing good. Until he until he cut does six. Wait for it. Wait for it. <laughs> yeah, there it is. I thought so. But that's it. There was a meat shield tactic. Uh, and now my spinal raptor can run through everything. Oh, it did make a noise when it came out. Interesting. Um so it's got no blocks. So one's killed it. One, two, three, four. One, two, three. Yeah, no blocks at all. Simple tail pap. Kill Superosaurus. Not a fully fledged Ravosaurus. It doesn't have the purple in there. What are you gonna do, buddy? Go for a full on four. I, I dare you. I dare you. Go on, do a four. Doesn't actually. Okay. Could have went for four blocks, probably doesn't. One, two, which has killed it. Factor in a two, because they usually go for two blocks. Oh my god, he went for a full on four. Interesting. He could kill me if he goes for three. I just want to see the Ankylo Darkus at level one. I also want to see the uh, uh, burn down times. Okay, so... As far as I've seen right now, this person, or in quotes, bot, bot uh, likes to block. So he's got another four. So I'm going to go for one, two, three, four. No, you know what? Screw it. No, I'm going to keep on doing four. I feel like he's going to do. Oh, thank God I didn't. Okay. Yeah, three's definitely killed him. Two would have. So, Angela Darkus, come on, baby. It looks like, um, is it Saltosaurus or something? It's something like that that I've seen in Dino Hunter Deadly Shores. Wow, that's that's going back some. Don't worry, that series is coming back. I'm just waiting for them to update it. Um, oh, does that kill me? 
Ah, four heads! My god! So instead of having a club tail, it has a club head. Makes sense, I suppose. Um, well, let's see Spanaraptors finishing. Oh, it had three. Wow, it had a, a lot. Wow! Oh, oh, survival. What is your IP? Thank you, survival servers. Uh, well, that was me, actually. Uh, I tweeted them saying, my server's not ready, guys. And they were like, what's your ticket? So, okay, right. Look at that 700 DNA. I would love that. If I win 700 DNA here, I might do this again. I might do this again. Be because it is five bucks, so it's not too much. I still think this is rigged because I've only ever won a common pack. And I mean, that is good, but I played it a lot, though. When to stop? Like... It, there's no, like, it goes round. It's all completely random. Go on, Whitney, you click it. You click it, Whitney. So, where it stops on, Whitney's won it. Oh! 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 Ah, oh, come on! <laughs> that was so close! <laughs> I was like, oh my god, Whitney, you've got to click it every time. But still, 140 DNA is not bad for five bucks. That's almost like 500 bucks gets you... 14,000 DNA. Wow, that was actually pretty damn good. Okay, guys, hold on a second. I'm gonna reply to that tweet. Okay, so that one didn't go so well. I'm not gonna spend 287 bucks, which is a crazy, crazy amount of bucks, um, to speed it up. I think in the previous video I said that it costs about 100, 200. No, it's 300 bucks. It's, it's, oh, it's ridiculous. It really is. Not only that, but you'd have to buy back your creatures, and they cost, let's have a look, they cost 110, 113, 69, just stupid numbers, really. Um, that's not even the hybrids, the hybrids probably cost more to buy back. Why can't I, why can't I move this? Oh god, retry! <laughs> that's why, because it wasn't even logged in. But a lot of, it was nice when I put up the video saying about what Ludi is doing and just the way this has happened because I got a lot of people saying, thank you, we've wanted somebody to say this for a while and I'm glad you're feeling exactly the same way. Because I am only human being after all and there's no reason for this. So that's the hybrids. Um, who have we not seen? Because this challenge, you can put in anything. Um, uh, oh, I, I kind of, I should do, I should live stream this and just be like, guys, who do you want to see? Because we've got, we can do this all day on fats. Um, who's my, you know what, who's my lowest? Who's, who's my absolute lowest? Oh my god, there's loads of rares that I just haven't leveled up. Oh god, oh god, who is the lowest, the worst of the worst? Is it Pelican Mimis? Oh, it's Tijong, of course it is. Oh, that's horrendous. Um, I think what I'm going to do is because this algorithm works out, it takes your team, averages it, then they put in their sort of team. Uh, hybrids work really well, so you get a really good team like, up against. Uh, I'm going to put in three Triceratops, see how that works out. It is just a gambling game. This is just gambling, whether you get, re get a return on the bucks, get a pack or whatnot. It's quite addicting. So we don't have a good matchup here. We have Pelican Mimis, which is alright. Then we have almost a level 30 Irritator, which is gonna kill us. And a Mijong, which is almost max. So, the tactic here is probably die. Um, nothing much we can do. Uh, meat Shield tactic is what I would go with. Yeah, Irritator's straight in. Not even, not even hanging about. I don't blame them. <laughs> don't blame them one bit. So we're gonna have to go for Meat Shield. Hopefully we'll get lucky. And they'll just block everything, but I don't think they will. Two hits has killed us. Uh, one hit hasn't, so if it goes for one hit, that would be good. It doesn't. Hopefully it's gone for two blocks, so we get our four now. Did go for two blocks, which is perfect. They've got three, so hopefully they will go for three. I'm hoping. That would be perfect. If they go for two, it sucks. Yeah, they go for three. Okay. Go for three, go for the overkill. Don't know why, really. If I was them, I probably wouldn't have went for three. Uh, so now we have the best opportunity to at least kill the biggest threat. So there you go, it's killed, and we get two in reserve. So we're not doing too bad, even though we're up against a Mijong next. Uh, Pelican Mimis, 
might not attack you because we might have two blocks. But it might. If it goes for four, I'd rather it just gone for four blocks, to be honest, not four attacks. Is it going to go for four attacks? One attack, perfect! Actually, that's even better. Because if you multiply the attacks on top of each other, it works out best. So if you go for one, it's just a waste. So I'm guessing he's went for some blocks, yeah. That was, it's better for me to invest in blocks than attack because some of them would have been wasted there. Yes, there is a method to my madness, don't worry. <laughs> I play, I try to play these games the best I can. I mean, oh yeah, see, we would have been open there and that probably would have killed us if we hadn't have went for blocks and attacks instead. I do, I played Pokemon so, um, and recently, like with X and Y playing with proper pure bread Pokemon AVs and RVs and God, what have you, so. They went for three. There we go. Hopefully that should have killed it with my one block. Oh, they got two! Damn! Sorry, I got, I got confused because I was talking to you guys. But yeah, I played Pokemon more competitively, so... I do have some skill involved here. It's not just Earthquake, Earthquake, Earthquake. <laughs> ah, that's killed it. So it's got one block. It's definitely got one block. But then we have to worry about Mahjong. We have to worry about the Mahjong. We're going to have to invest in blocks because... If they have a chance to kill us, they will take it. Um, so we're going to have to kill this with that. It's dead. Then Mijong could probably kill us in two attacks. So we're going to have to go for three. And then three. Oh, what? I've comp- Oh, oh, jeez. Sorry, I got completely sidetracked with talking to you guys. But we were basically dead from the start. I mean, I minorly could have won this. Probably. Um, go for three. Go for a full on three. Go on. Oh, yeah. We're, we're lost. There's nothing I can do against this guy. He's got a potential for three blocks. And even then, I'd have to waste all my attacks trying to kill it. Um, you know what? Let's go for the risky play. Let's go for the risky play. Yeah, risky play didn't work out. We're dead. <laughs> Is he going to take it? No? Okay. Three. So he's got, again, three blocks. Three blocks it could use. And... Four is not going to kill it. I'm going to go for another risky play. Go for four and four. Oh, he did go for majority of blocks, so... Yeah! Go for full on four, please! Please, do it! Full on four! Come on! I know I messed up, but please give me a chance. <laughs> Take me back! Ah! Possible three blocks. Possible three saves. Even if I kill Mijong and he did go for reserves, I'm dead. If he goes for blocks, I haven't killed him. So there's no point in me even trying. I've just got to wait for him to slip up. Yeah, it went in most of the reserves. I thought maybe. If he goes for six, we're dead. Go for four. Five? Oh, so one block. That did a lot of damage. One block, though. Shall we take this opportunity? I think so. Okay, one, two... And one. And then we are gonna have to go for... Three blocks, because there's a chance... Yes! Okay! Okay, we might have won. If it goes for a full-on four attack, we might have won. Please go for a full-on four attack. Please. I knew that two would kill me, that's why I went for three. Come on, we can do it. Triceratops can do it. <laughs> go for a four, please! Please go for four attack. Do it, do it, do it, do it. Ah, I knew it! Ah, I couldn't do it because if it has a chance to kill me, they always take it. So, what do I do now? He could have went for four reserves here. Could have went for four reserves. One, two, three. I've just got to go for full on four block. Oh, so he has six. Yeah, he's gonna kill me. It knows. It knows. It knows. Like, that's why they're bots. Because if they can kill me, they'll do it. Watch. It'll do it. There you go. See? It knew it could kill me. Oh. Well, I have to say, that was a long, long battle. Jesus. I could have won it as well if I just blum and concentrated. Uh, we'll do another one. Um, you know what? I'm curious. Let's do a tactic. I think I did before I stopped playing these because I, I was just like, I'm not winning anything. Um, a team that always would win for me was those. But before I do that, I'm going to go for really bad. I'm going to go for the worst. Or at least 
Just not great things at all. Um, let's just go for those two. I mean, they are level ones, but they are super rares. I, I can't be bothered to scroll all the way to get to some really terrible ones. And then... We're gonna pick... We're gonna pick some good ones. We're gonna pick a really good one. Let's pick Danetmon. And see what we get averaged up to. Because that those two Carnotaurs will bring my average really far down. Yeah, look at that. Look how far it brought down my average. All the way to rares. And we started out with quite an advantage against um, a Superosaurus. Still worried about the Kulasukas. Sorry, Kula... Is it? Yeah, it is Kool-Aid. Kool-Aid! Still worried about that because it's got advantage on everything. And it could be switched in. I mean, I'd love if it was switched in because then we could get it out of the way quick. Oh, what? One hell? Oh my god. Kind of Taurus. You bloody... Yeah, big bully. Come on, then. Go for two. Just go for two. Just do it. Don't try to reserve. You know you can kill me. Actually, it can't if it went for all blocks, so it might not. I would just go for two, please. Oh, a dinosaur swap. Into cooler sutures already? Okay, then. Uh, this is my biggest threat, so I don't even care. I'm going to attack. Yeah, I, I, there was a chance it did that, but I thought, let's do 15 damage. Let's go. And it rounded it up, actually. Instead of it being 14, it was rounded up to 15 damage. That's quite nice to know. So they give you the benefit of the doubt. Oh, two! Well, it's got nothing now. There's absolutely nothing. I could attack it with Dimetrodon. In fact, I'm going to do that. I'm going to attack it with Dimetrodon. Um, one, two, and it's dead. Go for one for safe measure. Go for... Two block? Yeah, go for two block, why not? Yeah, there you go. Well, I, I, I didn't calculate it right, but I gave myself an out just in case. I thought I'd put an extra attack in there. So, they're on four now. Uh, definitely can't kill me at all. I just wanted to be safe. So, I'm going to switch in Carnotaur here to just be another meat shield. Yeah, yeah, that's exactly what I'm going to do. Carnotaur, I'm going to switch you in. You're going to go for four reserve. And then we're going to go for a block. Because he's probably went for a block. Yeah, chances were. Now we're going to go for one just in case. Go for six. Come on, go for six. So, th so we got. I think we got lucky here. There could have been a chance that they went for loads of... Uh... Oh, he did go for six. Yeah, there was a chance he could have went for loads of amphibians. And he would have been screwed. Because it is just luck. Okay, so he's got no block, killed in one hit. <laughs> Literally killed in one hit. Go for full on four. At least I think. Yeah. Yeah, he's killed in one hit. I'm just going to give myself the benefit of the down, put an extra one in. Yeah, I thought so. There's nothing this Pachycephalosaurus can do, though. Even at maxed out. Yeah, it's, it's, it's done for. It's like a sunlight statue. The green sunset. So what are you gonna do, buddy? You're dead. Go for- go at least try to attack. Go on. It did! Oh, bless it. Chop, chop. Yum. 169. I'm sorry, buddy. Uh, I'm gonna kill you with one. Yeah, I'm just gonna kill you with one. There you go. <laughs> chop. And there you go. Full seven block, just in case. <laughs> oh, I, I like I like seeing the different animations. I never get to see the one. I think one is different to two. So, can we win a super rare legendary pack? Let's give it a shot. <gasps> Stop. No, not food. Oh, God. It didn't even switch. It didn't even switch to food. It was still stuck on the DNA. But it gave me food. And that, again, leads me to believe that as soon as you click stop, it generates your prize for you. Um, it's not like, ooh, you might land on this. It knows what you're going to land on. So we're going to do that once more. And hopefully we'll get just as lucky. And hopefully we'll get even more lucky and get something good. Um, what's bad? Carithosaurus. Yeah, I, I never use those. Let's use them. Carithosaurus. And the good one has to be a good. Let's be Indominus. 
Because I don't think they've rated the hybrids properly, because my matchup was really overpowered to theirs. Actually, you never know. Let's see. Let's see what happens here. <gasps> please, no amphibians. Please, no amphibians. I mean, even if I get halved, it's still 250 attack I've got. 270 or something. Oh, a Carnaraptor! Whoa! Hold on! Hold on! Hold on! That's a new hybrid! That's a new hybrid! That's Quetzal something! That's Pteranodon and Quetzal! Oh my god! An unreleased hybrid? We need to keep playing this just in case we bump into one. Holy moly, that's awesome! Quetzal, a something Quetzal. We need to just get to that. What is that? It's definitely got the back of, um... It's definitely got the back of Pteranodon, and it's definitely got the beak. And it, well, it had Quetzal, so it's Quetzal. Ah, what is it? I want to see it. Come on, just go for two. Just, just finish it already. Yes, thank you. Okay, you're completely blocked, like, dead. Indominus. Ah, three stars at level 10. Beautiful. Okay, Indominus, uh, just go for one attack. And three reserves. I mean, it, I don't think Carnaraptor can kill me. I don't think Conoraptor can kill me if it goes for a full-out attack. I don't think so. So we might as well just go for blocks. Oh, 842! Oh, okay. Yeah, Conoraptor doesn't stand a chance. Go on, attack me. Attack me, little Conoraptor. We're gonna eat you in one bite. Go for three. Oh, it goes for the swap! Into a Quetzal... Quetzal... Oh, no, is it just a Quetzal? Oh, okay. It's just a maxed-up Quetzal. It's not a hybrid. Of course, it doesn't got the purple star. Silly me. Okay, that was my bad. It could have went for two blocks here. So, I'm going to have to go for enough to kill it. And then, might as well go for two blocks anyway. Yeah, there we go. Sorry, I, I got you all hyped up. It's like, it's a new hybrid. It just looks different. That's what quite it looks, Max. Got a little fluffy tail. But this is a hybrid, this little dude. Oh, bless it. It's so small. You think a Carnotaur mixed with a Pyroraptor would have a really... It would sort of average out height, but no. It's just got a raptor size. Doesn't attack. Interesting. Interesting. Um, Gonna go for two blocks just in case. Oh, he's got six. So still four can't kill me if it goes for full on six. Oh, and it... Oh, it's got two blocks left. It's got two blocks. Possibly. Again, I'm going to go for another two blocks and four reserve. Yeah, there you go. We've won. Doesn't even matter if it blocks a four here. It's dead. It's dead in one hit, actually. Do I really want a Conoraptor now? Like, just looking at how bad it is in comparison. Of course we do. We're going to catch them all. Indominus. Finish her. Okay, I think this tactic works if you just put in two rubbish ones and a really overpowered one. You get averaged. Just, it works better that way if you just get averaged. And you've got two bad ones. Okay, come on. Last one. Last one. What's it gonna be? 700 DNA? Are you kidding me? Awesome! Yes! Oh, beautiful! For five bucks? That's the equivalent of spending 500 bucks for 70,000 DNA. Wow. Ooh, this is, this, I might actually do this in my spare time now, actually. I think I've gotten lucky, and I think, guys, what do you think? Did I get lucky that two of the ones I won, I got DNA? I think so. I think I got lucky. But if it's not, leave in the comments below, tell me what your experiences are with a pinwheel. I think most people who are on the group that you can find the link in the description below said that the pinwheel sort of fixed and it's just horrendously bad, but I got pretty lucky there. I don't know. Seemed pretty good to me. So if you like this video, leave a like and until next time, I'll see you later. Bye bye.